hey, 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 Tony Butter Bing, Horse Racing Nation. Hey, how you doing? Hey, thanks for uh, clicking on the video and during the season of thanks. If you and I have a little discretionary income in our pockets to bet on the horses, we've got a lot to be thankful for, don't we? So what am I thankful for this weekend? Churchill Downs, clock handicap, as we say in Boston. Pick five. We're going to go there. Going to single in the eighth race, going to spread in the ninth. I'm going to talk a little bit about the clock and I'll give you my ticket. So people say to me, Bing, how come we always got to face these like mating claimers or low level claimers in the pick five sequence? My response usually is, this is the life we have chosen, people. This is the life we have chosen. So we have a $8,000 non winners of two lifetime claiming event to kick off the pick five. And guess what, boys and girls? I'm going to single. That's right. Number three, Rompa Copo. Capo? Yeah, I think that's it. Listen, when you got a non-winners of two lifetime, take a look at these PPs. You got one for 22, one for 13, one for 11, one for 12. Rampa Capo is only one for five, okay? Dropped from maiden special weight all the way down to maiden 5,000 claimer one. Came off of that off a little bit of a rest. At this level, just missed. He's going to be near or close to the pace. He's got Kenny McPeak training, having a very good Churchill meeting. Robbie Alvarado aboard. You're going to get short odds. I take him over the uh, lifetime losers we have in here. So we're going to single, basically making it a pick four because a single doesn't add any any other uh, cost to your ticket. So race number nine, Oof. grade two, Revere, stakes, mile 16th on the turf for three-year-old fillies. Man, I see it. I see, see, see a pace battle up front. So we're going to go with seven deep in here. Seven. Number one, fault. Going to come late. I don't know if she's going to get there. Number three, West It. Trainer Graham Mount Ocean does well with first-time trainers. Number four, lovely Bernadette. Loves the turf. Winning or finishing third in her five lifetime starts on the green. Number six, Proud Reunion. Second swing at Stakes Company. Number eight, Journey Home. Here's another motion entrant. Just missed last time in Graded Stakes Company. Number nine, Daddy's Little Darling. Kentucky Oak, second place. My goodness, a lot of back class here. In well, Scat Daddy was, you know, her daddy, so she's gonna run well on the turf here. Number eleven, sensitive. Look at outclass, maybe little racing luck. Boom, big odds. Now let's jump over to the Clack or the Clark handicap. Listen, number seven, the player. When Bo Bradley gets him right, they stay right for a long time. Stakes winner in the last. I'm gonna hedge a little bit with number nine, diversify. Could go coast to coast if he gets the opportunity to be loose on the lead. Here's the pick five ticket. Three with one, three, four, six, eight, nine, eleven with six, eight, nine, with seven, nine, with one, seven, nine for $189. Good luck in all your wages this Thanksgiving weekend.